Hi everyone, today I'll be reviewing Bling Empire just dropped season 3 like it dropped yesterday and I see it's already trending and although I was thinking to myself when I saw the season 3 dropped so quickly because the last season 2 came out a couple of months ago I remember reviewing it now the season 3 is already here what do I think about season 3? first of all I want to say that I really like season 1 when they introduced this Bling Empire this you know reality slash all these rich people living in especially all the asian rich people living in la really like season one all the character i found them very interesting and all the conflict they had with each other really interesting too however season two i thought it was okay but season three however <laughs> this season felt really very uh, like stagey how do i say this like this season i felt like it was really stagey like keeping up with kardashian which is i didn't like to me season one and two at least it felt like they were real people you are watching on screen and this season they tried to create all this drama with each other and i'm like felt very staged which I don't like. Uh, that's the reason I don't like keeping up with Kardashian normally. Like I've never seen, maybe I have seen a couple of episodes, but I, wa I really like watching this one as I was saying. I lo loved learning about all these rich people for some reason. Although they are so beautiful looking and <laughs> I, I know many people find Kane uh, like he, he's very annoying so many people I see they're always like complaining about him however I really find him very funny and also sometimes he's saying all this real thing on screen because all this like Asian people you are seeing on a screen they are so pretty they are really pretty and all of them has things done you know like their lips done things done and <laughs> And the way he says all this thing, I really like it. Although I know he's always creating all this conflict with like them. That is why I guess the show become very soap opera type, like uh, which I did felt this season, like especially Kevin and Kim's, their relationship upside down. It f really feel very dramatic. Doesn't feel real. Uh, although Kevin, he always trying to blend in with all these rich people. And I always found his story to be very, you know, very real, honestly, very human-like, trying to blend with all these rich people. But after a while, you do get bored about it. You're like, oh, what am I watching here? All these people, they are, like, they do have all this drama, but this season feel like all these dramas are too much taste for me. Like, I didn't like it. So if I have to say the review about the whole season, I would say some of the episode was so boring and dragged all this scene. And I was like, really, they have nothing to do this season that they are just sitting there talking about all this useless stuff that nobody cares. <laughs> Show us some drama, uh, so much uh, some bling stuff. You know what I mean? That is what people want from this reality show. They want to see big uh, like especially this kind of reality show or normally most of the women are the audience which I do see it because like this kind of show obviously they are head it's not just Asian people are watching I imagine many other people are also watching this show so this kind of stuff do have you know huge market uh, but in this season you do see a lot of like celebrity cameo uh, especially this huge designer <laughs> that episode actually i really like when they went to the paris and this uh, designer uh like the clothes were on display and ca like the cabin was saying uh like the all these models they're so tall looks like giraffes are on hill <laughs> on hill walking and i was like this is what i want from this show but though that episode was toward the end really some of the episodes were really very boring and stress like too much trust i didn't like and i I'm gonna be honest here about this character named anna i really liked her in season one and two but in season three feels like she really got old very quickly i don't know if she got more stuff done or not uh, but to me feel like she really got old especially she's really older than other cast members like it feels a little odd like it's too hard like because like you although she wasn't with these people but like you know what i mean uh i really like this season they went to the this and here and there uh 
again who enjoyed season one and two you will feel a little bored because there is a lot of draggy scene like you're like they're just sitting there doing nothing and especially people who want to see beautiful diamond there is some beautiful diamond i like watching once again <laughs> and there were uh what is that actor he's from uh, mortal kombat he was in this show also one girl she was in this show like all the celebrity they actually work for netflix so i i do i'm not shocked that uh, they are here to give all this cameo because end of the day netflix also investing money for all this oh louis tan right i actually really like him he is actually really hot so can disagree with that so like he was here and uh you know netflix is is investing uh, be, like behind all these actors i'm not like surprised like he was here uh, because they, they do want him to be you know uh, more likable actually i really like louis tem i feel like he's a very likable person too uh like he's not talking too much like simu lu he does <laughs> he talks a lot <laughs> doesn't he but louis tem he's like uh then again, uh, I'm really excited to see him Mortal Kombat. Anyway, what do I think about season three? I thought season three was, uh, it was like there were up and down overall. Uh, people who like this show, they will find some uh, stuff is really draggy and boring. And overall, some of the episodes were quite enjoyable, as I was saying. Uh, and I, I was like, it was okay. <laughs> and that's my thought on this season. Let me know in the comment, what do you think about this show? And if you enjoyed my best review, don't share my other reviews. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe. Until I see you next time, please take care.